In creepy, nasty news. This one hurts. Yeah. This so, one hurts. I mean, we made a slap together, nigga. Look what you did. Uh, okay. You so, did all these years later. Shit. Ladies are taking all my shit off the board. <laughs> you might lose that versus now. No, that's a fact. Mm. That's, still a double, that's a still, double down. I'm still playing this. That's a double down. <laughs> yeah, I know. Ugh. I know. That's, that's oh, that. shit. Yeah, yeah it's crazy. Yeah. Damn. Well, Marcus Houston is defending his relationship um, or marriage, I should say, um, to his wife because apparently they, they met in like 2018. She was 17 at the time and he was 36. They got married in 2020 when she was 19 and he was 38. Um, and uh, well, here's a clip of him kind of explaining their uh, relationship. Yeah, my wife's situation is a little different, you know? How we were, how we met, you know, through mutual friends and everything like that. You know, I, when I met my wife, she was 17. So, you know, we had no really conversation and no really connection until, you know, she was of age. And, you know, it's, people don't understand it. And I got a lot of, of course, I got a lot of backlash for marrying someone that was 19. And, you know, when we did finally start to talk, I was like, this woman is like me. And she was just like, when I would talk to her, she just. No, that's true. Child, good night. No, no, that's, that's respect. Connection. And I feel like that's the most important thing. No, I we get it. We both love God. Oh. Oh. I see it from his point of view now. Yeah, God. Really? You know how that's God why you, you got to hear it from the horse's mouth, man, before you just jump to conclusions. What's up with these They had a spiritual things? connection. <laughs> but they ain't talk, though. <laughs> and they, though that's why it's spiritual. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And they had a lot in common. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um, if I was his PR, I would have literally, like, sh- just kicked the mic over and said, "This interview is over. Do not publish it." He sounds crazy right now. And first of all, okay, so they he met her at seventeen and said they had no connection. So what? The minute that that she turned eighteen, the, we the, the, I mean, the clock struck Ooh. twelve midnight on her birthday, y'all. and suddenly this connection just blossomed. He said he'd not the be even spoke between seventeen to and eighteen is a day. Michael Freeze told me that. And he's right. I never thought about it like that, dude. It's disgusting. It's well, disgusting, bro. Well, I don't look at those girls. <laughs> Fam, we never talk. He said, I heard that interview, but it was more, he said they never spoke. Like, he never talked to her. He never nothing until she turned 18. Mm. Which means I sized you up the whole 17. I was just waiting. And I was just yeah. waiting for the That's clock it. to strike 12 to turn you into a pumpkin. That's like, weird. Like, what are you talking about? That's yeah. nuts, B. That's weird. Marcus Houston, that's called grooming. There's, <laughs> there's a word for that. Mm. And hey, if that's your thing, I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's my expert opinion. That's your take. Yeah. <laughs> See, my my, my beef. But but why do you have to just rush to do an interview? Like, why you got to do an interview about that? If, there's no way to make this sound palatable because the niggas look at it mm. just in terms of legality. Mm. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. It don't be. That's about it. More. That's they all they care about. The little girl. Yes. Yeah, Yo, if the law tomorrow told them niggas 16, that 16, they would start marrying 16. Was, what, he's exactly. Right. He's right. That's why all that shit nasty. He's right. They just looking at it. Okay, well, what's the age? 18? Okay, hold on. We go, up. Oh, you 18 now. You've been wanting that girl for God knows how long. My thing was, he was like, yo, she's like me. My nigga, you have been around the world. You've traveled around the world. You've touched money. You got experiences. No, you a, know what? That the, that, you know, let me tell you, that's, he's probably absolutely right. Because of the fact that he's been a, you know, quote unquote, child star and stuff like that, I definitely think that there is a suspended state of like, of, of his perception of reality and that he is like emotionally stunted in certain ways. So, yes, you probably are the same age mentally. Absolutely. I'll go with that. No, I'm not mm-hmm. riding with that. <laughs> no. mm-hmm. Like I said, them niggas travel. I'm, the I'm world. being I'm being super facetious, facetious gotcha. right now. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. But yeah, like dog, you can't say that this girl is like you or have anything in common with you. I mean, she might got some commonality, but my nigga, you 40 years old. He's using God as like and the you, thing. I hate that. I hate that. Because yeah, 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 right. that. that Dalai Lama really used God too. Mm. And the Pope. Mm-hmm. People use God to justify some real fucked up shit. Facts. War, rape, yeah. slavery. theft, War. slavery. It's some bullshit. Get your shit off, man. I'm just saying. And he's, talking, he's doing the interview saying, I got so much backlash. What you thought was going to happen? But what is he promoting on this That's interview? what I want to say. Like, It's not an album coming. You don't that. have a diet tea coming to sell us. <laughs> you ain't got the fucking... Pump it up The too. male Faha. Like, what are you... What are you you're not selling us shit. 
So what's the point of doing Why the interview? Why are you doing an interview? But yeah. we don't know that. He might have something coming soon, and niggas have shitted on him. And he's I doing do, damage so control? He kind no, of, yeah. stop. Stop. He don't have nothing. Nope. He don't have nothing coming soon, and he's leading with, let me tell you why I groomed this girl. <laughs> <laughs> something might be coming, my nigga. Not leading with that. I don't know. It's it's It seems if preemptive. If that nigga drop an album in a month and say, yo, buy my shit. But I got to get this out the way first to do the damage control before to let y'all know why. We'll Is see. there like a tour happening? There's a bunch of tours that are like coming up this summer. Are they supposed to be on tour or something a like that? A bunch of what? Tours. What? Tour. Tours. <laughs> tours. Well, I thought it was just me. I ain't going to hold you. I was looking. What, what did the fuck I, she what say? What did it sound like? Tours. A tour. Yeah, what you say? A what's, tour. The, what's, what's the Dolphins quarterback name? <laughs> Tour. Melissa, what are you saying? I said there's a, a bunch tour, of nigga. musical tours coming up this summer, so is he going to be are you on saying a- like tours? <laughs> tour. Tour. What is happening here? Yes, tour. Tour. Where are you Russian? <laughs> like, are you Italian? Like, did we just get to Italy somewhere? Why are you talking like that? What do you mean? How, am I saying? A tour. 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 T W O. Tour. Dash E-R. <laughs> <laughs> Not a tour. 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 A tour. Not a tour. Do you you guys realize I'm fucking Canadian, right? <laughs> Y'all do weird shit what you use. <laughs> yeah, it's a thing. Like, Don't blame it on Canada. No. It, tours. No. Just tours. Uh, tour. There we go. Tour. Stop. Where we no. <laughs> you got you went yeah, back. Cool. I'm with you. You know what? When I first got here, somebody I said I, I said something about I've been somewhere, and they're like, you, huh? you, exactly. They did Wait, that. What are you saying? Bean. You eat beans. And I've, you say? I've, I've, I've it's like I've been beans. to Colombia. I've been to Wait, coffee beans. Erase his number. <laughs> <laughs> Don't text him. Don't call him. Don't talk about work. <laughs> you tours. Are, you better thank. <laughs> hey, I'm wrong. I'm bugging out. Yo, you better thank your lucky heavens. <laughs> It'll be, it be bad. bad, yo. <laughs> Holy shit. New Joe Biden.